Nine at six here on Channel 7. The city of Newark has a very effective program to deal with kids who play hooky. Tim Fleischer explains how it works. When you go to school with these guys, the golden rule is reading, writing, and roundup. And truant officers Bob Merck, John Onasilla, and police officer Tom Hayes are dedicated teachers. With Newark's Truancy Task Force, the lesson of the day is to round up students and get them back into the classroom. We try to get them before they see us. This way there isn't any chase or anything like that. Yeah, they know us. Yeah. He's gone. I'm after him. Go around. And the chase is on with truant officer Bob Merck in hot pursuit down Market Street. A block away, they get the kids. Did you drop out? Yeah. You dropped out? Your mother came and signed you out? That's a pretty good foot chase you put up for him. <laughs> Keep the pressure on. And they do this every day, five days a week, with only four teams of officers here in a school district where there are 54,000 students in 85 schools. This school year alone, they have rounded up over 7,000 students. Since its beginning five years ago, the Truancy Task Force, with a great deal of help from the Newark police, in many ways, though, has been more than just another way to round up truant students. We find many social problems. We find uh, many times a catalyst, to real root to the, the, the cause of the truancy. And uh, that's the, probably the key to uh, eradicating uh, the truancy. Go to Montgomery. Mm -hmm. You late today? Yeah. What grade are you in? Two. Many times the same student is picked up week after week, but that's why there is the need, as the officers say, to keep the pressure on when the chase is on. Reporting from Newark, Tim Fleischer, Channel 7 Eyewitness News. All right, and still ahead today on Eyewitness News, Stormfield joins us with the forecast. Also, a success story in the so-called border babies controversy.